All right, this is Oleg Shilovitsky with OpenBOM. In my video today, I will give you an update about the progress of OpenBOM development uh, with Autodesk Revit integration. So let's speak today about Digital BOM and how OpenBOM enables you to create a Digital BOM from your Revit project. So for the sake of this example, I will work with a very small demo project from Autodesk Revit. And uh, I will start from a simple configuration of uh, OpenBOM uh, add-in for Autodesk Revit. So uh, in this video today, I will demonstrate a very basic function, but what is most important, I will demonstrate to you how fast you can create an output, output of digital BOM uh, from Autodesk Revit and how this output will summarize all information about uh, objects that you have in this project. That, so that will be a foundation for a digital bill of materials that you can use for different phase of your construction project and activities. So let's get started. So I navigate to settings just to demonstrate you that everything we do here is uh, integrating and uh, enabling a login for OpenBOM platform and uh, that uh, that's it, so I can leave the screen. And now let's focus on export function. Uh, let's focus on simplicity. OpenBOM supports multiple type of bill of digital BOM created. So I will focus on the level structure. And I will focus on the type of export will be quantities because I would like to focus on how to get all objects and their correspondent quantities from uh, Autodesk Create project. So I select this uh, information and I start to scan all categories and all information that you have in this project. So let's start from default settings. What we do now is that we scanned all information that you have in this Revit project. So it's a small project. Of course, for larger project, it can take longer time, but uh, just focus on simplicity and the automation, OpenBOM uh, selects automatically the properties based on default settings and uh, enable us to um, create, a, create a digital BOM. So what I do is that just select everything and uh, click on OK button. So pay attention, like just a few clicks so what happens now is that the information is scanned and you can see the uh, summary of all objects and categories that are going to be exported to the digital BOM. So uh, 93 objects total, very small demo project, but the most important thing here is that you will understand what is the fundamentals of uh, Open BOM for uh, uh, Autodesk Revit. So, and uh, we start to extract the information. So what, what happens now is that OpenBOM goes to uh, Revit data, extracts the information, and send this information to OpenBOM uh, cloud service. So, and uh, that's what we get. So we get uh, multi-level BOM categories. This is the type of, um, this is the type of BOM that we created, and I can navigate directly to uh, the uh, digital BOM that created in uh, on the open BOM platform. So let's take a look. So basically we get now information about the project and I'm expanding levels. So it's an interesting thing that you can see is that you can see actually the entire structure of the project and all components and all information that you uh, have in this project. So as you can see, we navigate through the uh, different uh, families of objects like doors, uh, plumbing fixtures, lighting fixtures, and many other uh, type of objects. So uh, OpenBOM created a structure that you allows you to drill down. So if I'm drilling down to uh, doors, I'm drilling down uh, in the levels. Remember, just to remind you, here we selected the uh, level structure, which means that OpenBOM not only extract uh, categories and objects, but also 
will extract them in correspondence to the level in your uh, building project. So I navigate to uh, the level and I can see what are the objects that located in this level and the correspondent quantities of all these objects. As you can see, OpenBOM gives you a very easy and efficient way to calculate not only to capture data, to calculate quantities and to provide a structured form of representation quantity per particular group of objects like for example uh, level but also a total summary. So uh, OpenBOM also allows you to uh, turn this uh, list into a cross uh, project selection report which would be a flattened bomb and allows you to get all information about all these uh, objects and uh, that gonna be uh, that gonna, gonna be uh, summarized and of course you can uh, see the total quantities and you can navigate through all this information and you can get information about what objects uh, are presented in this project and what are the quantities filter this information what is important is that once you created a digital bomb in OpenBOM, you can use this digital bomb for different purposes. And such purposes is uh, taking this information for planning, taking this information for uh, purchasing and uh, many other tasks. But so far, take a look how easy uh, you can create and capture digital bomb from Autodesk Creative Project. You can drill down through this information, see what is the information and also use um, very efficient uh, sharing capabilities of uh, OpenBOM platform. Sharing capabilities like Google uh, document sharing, you can share data with your uh, other project um, engineers, architects, contractors and everyone else. So uh, to summarize, a single click option to create a digital bomb from Autodesk Revit. Get this information, slice and dice this data and share this information with everyone for the consumption such as uh, procurement, uh, project planning and many other tasks. Uh, in my next video I will show you actually how you can perform purchasing directly from Open Bomb digital platform using catalogs provided by different contractors. So stay tuned for the next videos and I will see you very soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.